but when students present and past are coming to you to tell you that something is wrong, whether it's anonymous or not, you should take that, listen to it, and make a change. We believe that anyone with an accusation, whether you were found guilty or not, should not be allowed in a school area. On top of that, we've heard stories about teachers that have recently left um, being inappropriate, not appropriate at all for students, um, counseling for the kids multiple times from reporting their abusers. I mean, kids reporting their abusers and the counselor calling their abuser to fact check them. Kids being sexually assaulted at their matric dance and coming to the school to say I've been sexually assaulted. The school says I'm going to give you counselling. It never happens. The counselling system, the entire attitude, the environment is failing kids and that's why we're here to fight
from day one has made a tremendous toll in the last week. Thank you so much for the constant noise you guys have been making on social media.
students and why these matches were swept under the rug. We call for Bruce Robert Benson to step down.
We are sexually harassing learners in the school. The principal is quiet because he knows these educators. We have to continue. Kenya must go because it's going to harass another learner. We need Kenya to kill a young lady inside in this crisis of sexual violence of GPC in order for the school to wake up. We are here to